Hi there, this is Storm for once again and a new video. The, this video I want to make, and I think it's number 17 at the moment, the tutorial. Uh, I want to show you where to find the uh, record pike on the fifth map. The fifth map, yes. And uh, first I want to show you uh, which type of equipment I'm using. Um, I'm using Allura. And the lure that I'm using is the Sakura Jack X Shed. And again, the Albina Trout I'm using. You can probably also use others, but this one I'm using for the pike. So, what I'm going to do is going to this map, it's the called Forgotten. Uh, find an empty room. Yes. Okay. First of all, I want to show you where I am, of course, on the map. If you see here on the map where I am, you see here a couple of reeds or something that is called three green grass poles. Uh, and it is called Bucht Zumpf. And I am near the edge of the water here on this side. Okay, closing the map now. Also, of course, lower down to 90%. And I just walk up the front here. Lower down the tension of the inner circle six times. And I want to check with the scanner so I can show you. This is 10.38 and what I found out is the record is around bike, 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 um, around 28 kilograms, 28 and then 38, uh, 20, uh, yeah, 28 comma 38. So 28 or 29, if you have a C of 29, that's surely a record fish. So you must be at least above no, 24, 23 kilograms. You see many pikes here. Four in my screen. It's, that's that's the, on my uh, scanner screen. That's uh, very much. And of course, if you uh, catch some pikes here, it will respawn maybe the record fish. So just go here and start fishing. Reel them in. And let's see if maybe a record fish will spawn. You only have to reel it in in a good pace and also on a slow pace. Yes, there's the first one. Okay, full power. And by the way, I have never seen so many pikes on one spot. If this was a real thing, it isn't possible because uh, a pike is a solo predator. They never uh, uh, stick around with four of them at the same spot. So this is not real. But it's a game after all. And it's nice to catch them. And I'm looking forward to that they really make a change about uh, how big a fish uh, a pike really is. So, let's see if there are different in size. This is one is 18 kilograms. Nice big one. Okay. Okay, hold it down six times. And go for the next. So, I'm targeting for myself the 27 kilograms or 28. I haven't seen it yet. So, I just want to catch them all, reel them in, go sell and go back to the same room as I am now. 
because I want to let them respawn. Okay. You see, in a short time you will catch a lot of them. is get a little bit away from the water then walk in and then I can put it in my landing net oh, it's not even that big I thought it would be bigger because of it was a little bit more difficult to reel in I would suspe suspect that the bigger it is it's the more difficult to reel in but Sometimes that's not the uh, issue. I find that strange, but, uh, but I. Who am I? <laughs> what I'm doing all this time is uh, do my trick of pumping up and down, bring tension to the line, so the fish will be tiring soon. And get it closer to the shore so I can walk to it. So like now I just walk to it. Yes. Oh that's a nice one. <laughs> and I'm leveled up also. That's nice. And I level up. I will also check the store to see if better equipment is available. But that I'll have to wait outside the tutorial. I'm only now going for the bike. <laughs> you see, in only uh, seven half minutes, I have many bikes, and they gave a good, good amount of money together. I walk away. Yeah, come on. Ah, that's even better. You look, uh, the big pike here, and my net is full. Uh, let's see. Because I forgot to check which room I'm in. And there's no option to see in which room you are. So, okay, I just have to go to sell them. You see, it gives a good amount of money. And it doesn't say which room I was in. So. Okay, let's go to room four, uh, 50. It's an easy number. So, what I wanted to do was going to the room and then fish every pike away. And if they respawn, maybe it will spawn a record fish. I don't check with the sonar now because I know they're all there. Yeah, I've got it to lower the tension down because I was reeling in too fast. And then they don't grab it. But you see, only seven minutes I catch them all, maybe. Miss it the full net, so do it again. No problem. I think it's fun to catch them. You have something to do. So, it looks big. 
but like I said, it doesn't say anything because they're still working on the size of the fish. You don't see on the size of the fish how big it is. How really, uh, how much kilograms it is. They still have to fix it. I'm glad they do because now a small fish and a big fish almost look the same and that's not what you want. You want to be, have a big fish to look big. One moment. So, here I'm back again, someone had to get my attention, <laughs> I didn't before, didn't have it before. Okay. Just keep it above, between the two lines, and uh, come back, come. yes, there it is. These are small ones, but every uh, every fish is a placeholder, and this was ex actually a small one, so it, it did look small. That's better. But I think that they will be more accurate in the near future. So a real big pike will look like a real big pike. You maybe almost can't hand, yeah, can't keep it in your arms. Normally, how much struggle this one is will suggest that it's a big one. Just try to pump it to the shore. When I'm close enough, I will walk in to scoop it up. Because it's easier when you're standing away a little bit, not uh, right at the edge of the shore. Because the closer to the shore you need to pull it, the more difficult it seems. And now I just pull it to the shore and when near enough like this I just walk in and it will be scooped up. Yes. Twenty four kilograms. That's a nice one. I like every pike that's above twenty kilograms. I think that I got them all on that spot. Try a little bit on this side. I see some rimples again in the water. But they aren't still yet from these parts. That is too soon. This is a small one.
There is some uh, ridge there at, at the bottom I see because uh, there, uh, yeah, when you come across such thing it will right away bring the lure down. That's what I found out. It seems like a perch. Yes. I just throw them away. I just want to uh, catch all the pike that I see. The wimples in the water. I suggest there is a pike beneath it. You see, it's touching now down. There's something in the water that will bring my lure down. You will notice uh, yourself if you uh, start spinning and sometimes you are in a river and then it will go to you and it will float up and down, float up and down, from the bottom up, bottom up and bottom down. See, there is something there in the water that is bringing it down. But that is sometimes also the spot where the fish is hiding and it will bite right away when it's going up again. So I don't mind if this is happening. See, also a witch there in the water. There's fish there, yes. Hmm, give not uh, much tension, but also a small pipe. Is it a pipe or something else? Oh, there's a nice perch. Yeah, you can go inside, it's my. I just want to empty the spot of every pike. Because what I'm trying to do now at the moment is try to catch a record spike. But surely you do understand that a record pike is something totally different. Also, a nice perch. It's a good spot for a nice perch. There's something. I see sometimes there. There is something hiding. Let's see. Let's bring it over the wimples in the water. You see there is something jumping out of the water, it's a little far away, something about there, trying to get over it, it's very far, but I can reach very far with my rod and my line. I think there is respawning again, yes, you see? Right away it's respawning now, in front of me, you see them also out of the water. So it's worth trying again. Or maybe I just uh, go scanning, because I want to see for a record pipe. It's a submerge. A chip? Okay. I didn't uh, see that coming. Okay. Check with my scanner. 27. Now, this is not a record for a pike, but it's coming in. It's coming in the, in the range.
at least it will give you a good amount of money and experience of course so these are huge bikes like I said 28 kilograms is the maximum at the, uh, at the time um, below 28 I mean if you see one of 28 try to get it because it's definitely a record fish and who was who don't want to see his name or her name in the record fish uh, list I haven't been there, so it would be nice to be there. But you have to do something for it. Okay, this is the big one. 27? No, it's not the 27. 25 and like my yeah I can't even get the, the big one so what I'm going to do now sell you can see that it's a nice amount of money and then go back right away to 50 that was the room I was in go to the same spot just keep on continuing because I was here right before it has not been changed and I would advise that you just continue uh, for a couple of hours maybe hours and maybe it's not a little bit too long but just try hopefully you will uh, catch a record fish at least you uh, have found here a very good spot to catch bike big bike huge bike so I just think I will uh, finish my tutorial I have shown you what to do here and I just keep on continuing fishing and maybe you will see my name in the record list getting a bike on this spot on this map. I hope you have uh, enjoyed the video. A ah, very nice one. And uh, enjoy, see you next time and thank you for watching. Goodbye.